Incoming! Get to the bridge. Cosmos Tower is the quickest way. Too wide to cross. Maybe we can bridge the gap. We keep saying bridge, and it's starting to sound like a made-up word. Drax, I have been eager to topple something over. We should be prepared in case the Grand Unifier arrives. I'm more than ready. Really? A Faith Force field? If we can find the power source, we should be able to turn it off. Let's get looking, then. You see that kid in the ritual thing? I could not miss him. You think the church did that to his head? Or was the poor sucker born like that? You gotta disconnect the power, Quill. Something to shut off the power? If you do not have the upper body strength, perhaps your magic gun is That's it, Peter. Let's go. We need to get out of here before Raker shows up. All right, get ahead. Let's book it! Now is not the time for literature! But this would make a great story! If we're alive to tell it! Huh. So, Gamora... Are you... uh, how am I supposed to drop the most interesting thing she's ever done? Why do they keep blocking everything off? 
Because now they expect us. We need to find another way to the bridge. <clears throat> you know, I usually hated when that Cosmo spotlight would shine down on me. But now I kind of miss it. I did not know you were so sentimental. Almost drowning changes a guy. Guardians of the galaxy. The Matriarch has chosen to enact the fulfillment from this station. And you shall not stop her. She hasn't chosen anything. You've been manipulating her from the start. She is the light. And I am merely her servant. Kind of hard to be the light with that dark monster thingy inside of her. Blasphemy! You may have rejected her. But you will believe when it returns you from death's cold clutches. Your pain has pushed you to a perilous precipice, old friend. You die. The form is fleeting, but the foundation remains forever. Now cease this stubborn senselessness before it reaps a ruinous reward.
He's boosting everyone but us! We must eliminate their okay. conduit! Oh, sniper! Fast cowards! We need to close this distance! <laughs> his face. It was all like, oh, my gilded glutes. Regal rear is perfect posterior. His champion cheeks. Look out! Let's not add to our problems. Stay away from the edges. I gotta get close to get over. I guess Goldie survived! 
inside that jump! The warlock is more valiant than I believed! String him up, Ruth! Paraxis will tell tale of our battles here! Is that like a katana get a minstrel? Too close! We gotta get to that elevator! At least the rooftops will provide some cover! Blow him up! Of course it was easier to get to before! How many are there? It's like all of nowhere, Jonah! As long as they're here, they can't go through the... Whatever they called it! The full floor! That does not the game! I scrambled more than his brain with that one! Stop that weirdo deserve it! Well, I guess Goldie survived that jump! I swear, if Warlock kills Rager before I get a chance! So many lousy angles to cover! I will fight them! Hey, Quill! Wanna see some fireworks? We'll tell tale of our battles here! But what now? Where? It should be, uh, right below us. Must suck to be a celestial head just floating around the edge of the universe's stuck toilet. We need to be on the other side of this thing. We're not getting over. Would under suffice? Warlock better not kill Raker before I get to him. I am eager to pull that sorcerer's insides to the outside. <laughs> I don't need another round. Warlock can squeeze the life out of that freak for all I care. I did see a floor directly below this one. I ain't seeing no hatch or nothing. Hey, Quill, try your visor. Always knew nowhere would get raided, but not like this. Thought it would be the world mine cracking down on him. They do have Nova Corps converts in their forces. Part of the floor looks weak. Good thing we got old big boots. It is not the size of the boot, but the might of the one who wields it. What's so special about Goldie anyway? Drax, buddy, let's make a hole. That's one way down. The best way. <laughs> Look! They're still at it! At least our guy seems to be winning. Anyone see a way across? I am broke. Yeah, we can't do nothing with that sign in the way, Quill. Always wondered, what did you use to do that? Some kind of mega bomb? Ba 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 boom, baby! We sure are destroying a lot of advertising today. Like we need another reminder to buy Calex cream. Yeah. You gonna make us a bridge or what? Don't suppose Groot knows another side route. If I could just get to the other side, I could hack that thing and drop the bridge. If you can get to the other side, we can get to the other side, and it wouldn't matter. 
throw me. What? Throw me? Just get muscles to huck me across. Do you have any idea how far down it is if you miss? We ain't got time to argue. I'll make it. Leave this to me! Whoa! Glad that was a You are a valued member of this team. Not a tool to be thrown about. Worried about this ritual. And what's really gonna happen if we can't stop it? Ain't gonna be dead people coming back, holding hands and wagging tails, that's for sure. No, more likely Magus will use the ritual's power to drain the life energies of all in attendance. We won't have to worry about that. I know I can get through to Nikki. This is Raker's doing, not hers. I won't give up on her either. Nor will I. Yeah, and neither will the Grand Unicorn. He will regret it. Perhaps we should summon the ship to deliver us to our destination. Ain't no way they'd let us land anywhere near the big party. Better off fighting our way there. Indeed. I would much rather face them with my blades. How dumb are these Flartnards to even fall for this full Flarkman garbage? Magus demands adulation, trapping you with vile illusion while feeding on your soul. I felt it in my promise, too. That endless... hunger. Oh yeah. Hungry is an understatement. Holy faith! All that light isn't leading to the Cortex. It is the Cortex. How could that mutt let this happen? Looks like you'll get to ask him yourself. This isn't gonna end well. Cosmo! We've got to get down there! Don't count him out just yet. I've seen him get out of worse scrapes. Yeah, we can. 
Clark are you doing? He's one of them now. He's our friend. Yeah, so is Drax. And I ain't going inside this Fleabag's head. Maybe it doesn't have to come to that. Hey, buddy. Are you, uh... <laughs> It's too late. Wait! He's still in there. I can hear him. I hear only barking. Focus your mind. He's there. Uh, oh, Fark it, just shoot the mutt! No! You can do this, Peter. Uh, easy, bud. Friends, remember? He's beautiful. Cosmos never lie. Yeah, buddy. It's me. It's all of us. Where is it? Cosmos smell. Smell of nowhere. Where else would we be, Furbrain? His mind is addled. Or he is simply a dog. He doesn't see us. He's still in the promise. Cosmo, where are you? What do you see? Blue sky. In cars to chase. Cosmo is big. Duma. How you say? Home. He's talking about Earth. Smell of fresh grass. Feeling of dirt between paws. No psychic burden. Just walkies for going. And the ball for fetching. If you missed your home planet, could you not simply return at any time? Not at time that matter. Same reason Katarian, not go home. Earth was great. Cats to chase, trees to be on. But the point is... I get it. We all get homesick. But you gotta bury that bone and move on. Pyotr Quill does not know what he ask. He's like fleas. Biting and biting, no matter how much Cosmo scratch! Oh, you Terrans have a real thing for your home planet. What's one hunk of rock over another? It's not about rock. It's about what Cosmo had on rock. Foot of bed for sleeping, belly for rubbing, collar with name. You miss being someone's property? Cosmo not property. Belong to family. Then one day... Family gone. Men in suits sent Cosmo into space. Cosmo searched many dog years for those he lost. But yet... You... had owners. It sounds like they gave you up. Family would never turn back on Cosmo! What about your puppies, Cosmo? They're your family! Cosmo Young are... They're here, man! And they're counting on you! For love? For protection? But humans call for Cosmo to heal. Must be loyal. Those pups actually need you. Be loyal to them. Don't abandon them in space the way you were. Cosmo would never. But you have. They're somewhere here on nowhere, maybe needing your help right now. Come on, Cosmo, you gotta know this doesn't smell right. Peter Quill is right. Cosmo human have no smell. They are wicked perversions. You must bite them with all your might. Be gone! Cosmo not fetch your lies. That's it, buddy. You tell him! Nowhere is Cosmo home be. His pups, his family, will protect the all cause. Sick him, boy! Should we help him? I mean, we may need him. I am optimistic for the beast's recovery. Cosmo's got his mission. We've got ours. Let's get to the Cortex.